Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Um, I hope you're all doing well and having a good week. Um, so I thought for this week's video we could do a what I wore in a week. Um, it's actually Saturday today so I'm starting it off at the weekend but I have a few things um, coming up this week and I thought it might be helpful to show you some of the spring outfits um, that I'm wearing like day to day. Um, so today I am heading out for a like kind of like early dinner, very late lunch. So I've gone for a relatively casual outfit. Um, so I'm wearing a top from Pretty Lavish. Um, you can't see the detail on it, but it's basically a cowl neck um, black satin top. I love these tops. Um, I have one in white as well. Um, and I know Pretty Lavish do a white version too. Um, but I just think they're such a great alternative to a um, t-shirt for a slightly more dressed up look, but still super effortless. Um, they'd also be so good if you work in an office as well. Um, and yeah, just a really great staple for spring. Um, and then I have my Zara belt on and my jeans are from H&M. These are in a slightly darker wash, which I really like. Um, they are the loose fit mum jeans. Um, I know they definitely still do this style, but I'm not sure if they'll still do um, this wash because I got mine last year. Um, but hopefully they do and I will leave them linked. Um, also, for anything that isn't um, in stock, I will, of course, be leaving alternatives linked in the description box too. But yeah, these are one of my favourite styles of jeans. Um, they're really great if you have a smaller waist but like bigger um, thighs and a bum, um, which is my kind of body type. Um, because they aren't too like tight around um, your thighs so they are pretty comfortable um, and then I have a old pair of shoes on from Zara they're just these really cute little low heeled um, sling backs with the bows on the front um, and then my bag is my Celine Triumph and I am just going to go and grab my trench coat now to show you and then I have just added my trench coat to finish off the outfit um, my one is H&M but a couple of years ago um, but I saw one on Arquette the other day which I absolutely love. Um, I'm actually thinking about ordering it myself. It just looks like the most classic trench um, in a slightly darker tone than this one. Um, so yeah, I'll leave that one linked. But I would say overall this look is kind of like a very classic Parisian inspired outfit and I cannot wait to go and eat my body weight in food now. So it is Sunday today so naturally we have a very casual outfit of the day. Um, today I've just been shooting some content whilst the weather has been nice um, so it's been a very chilled day but I've actually just shot um, this look for a reel which um, if all goes well with the editing um, will be up tonight so I might put it at the side here or if not you'll have to head over to my Instagram which is Lily Isabella Clark um, to watch that but we are just about to head out for a dog walk, so I thought I may as well keep this outfit on. Um, so I am wearing a cap, and it's not very often that I wear a hat, to be honest. Um, and I'm not really sure if it suits me, but um, I thought it went nice with the rest of the look. But this is from Adenola. Um, and then I have my leather jacket on. Oh god, that's annoying me. I keep hitting the buckle on the radiator. Sorry about that. Oh my god. But yeah, my leather jacket is from H&M. Um, and they brought this back recently. So I will leave it linked below. Um, but it's literally the best oversized leather jacket I have ever come across. And then the sweatshirt I have underneath is actually from a new brand that I hadn't heard of. Um, they are called Worst Behaviour, but spelt like abbreviated um, and they reached out to me on Instagram to see if I would like some pieces and honestly I am obsessed with this brand um, I'll show you the sweatshirt in full in a second but I literally haven't taken it off um, it's incredible quality and the perfect cream shade and um, I love how this like cobalt blue um, like contrast with the cream as well I think it looks so cool um, they also sent me another set which I'm sure I will have on at some point this week so you'll probably see that then 
um, and then I'm just wearing some white well cream um, mum jeans these are from Naked um, I've had them a few years so I'm not sure if they will still be available but if not I've seen that H&M have quite a few good pairs of cream jeans um, in at the moment so I will leave some options linked and then I have on some brand new um, black high top converse I haven't had a pair of these in God, it's got to have been over 10 years. But these actually just arrived this morning. Um, so this is the first time I am wearing them. Um, the reason I got these was because, well, they're just such a classic, aren't they? Um, but I have a pair of Evasias, which I wear loads. I think the style is called Espler. Um, but I've had them like over a year and they're just looking a little bit grotty. And plus, I also think that Converse work better with a casual outfit. Whereas the um, Evasias, I feel like you can dress up a little bit more. More. and here is a better look at the sweatshirt and um, so obviously it's got the logo here and then it also has it in a huge um, print on the back and I just think it's so cool I absolutely love this shade of cream I think it's the perfect tone and it's a really nice oversized fit I'll just untuck it um, so yeah, you can see it's quite a nice fit. Um, I'm not sure what size I went for, but I will obviously put it down in the description box. Um, but yeah, I am absolutely loving this at the minute. So it is Monday today, um, and here is today's kind of like smart casual look. I have just been having an admin day, so just like editing and all that good stuff. Um, but I just fancied putting on a nice outfit. Um, sometimes I just feel a little bit more productive when I put on like a proper outfit um, rather than just like sitting around in loungewear. Although don't get me wrong, I do that as well. But um, today I just fancied on putting on something a bit smarter. Um, so I am wearing a cardigan from H&M. Um, this is a wool and cashmere blend. Um, it's amazing quality and I've had this probably a couple of months or so now and I wear it all the time and um, it's a really good kind of like layering piece for the spring season um, and then underneath I have a t-shirt on from Arquette um, this is just one of their classic heavyweight t-shirts um, just a simple crew neck and then I have on a pair of trousers from H&M. These are the ones that I have in quite a few different colours. Um, if you've watched my recent videos, you probably will have heard me talking about these. Um, but they're just really comfortable and um, they're in a really good material as well. I think it's either lyocell or viscose, um, but they don't crease very easily. So they would be great in a like office environment or something like that. Um, because you aren't going to be looking completely dishevelled by the end of the day. And then my loafers are from Zara. Um, I got these last year though, but I'll try and link something similar. Um, to be honest, I've just put them on to film this clip because um, I haven't been wearing any shoes today. Um, but yeah, that is today's look. So it is now Wednesday and I am so sorry, I completely forgot to check in yesterday. Um, but I just had a boring day doing a wardrobe clear out. Um, so I was literally just in loungewear all day. But I think I'm actually going to carry on the um, video a little bit um, over the bank holiday weekend. So hopefully that will make up for it. Um, but today I am actually heading out for lunch and um, drinks with my friend. Um, we're going to Six by Nico, um, which is a restaurant I've been to a couple of times before, but basically it's kind of like a six course menu um, and it changes every maybe like a couple of months or something like that. Um, so today's menu is Ancient Rome, which I am very, very, very excited for. Um, there is a lot of pasta on the menu and honestly, I can't wait. Um, I'm definitely gonna do the wine pairing as well. So it is a um, very casual fine dining situation on a Wednesday afternoon. Um, but this is my outfit. So I am wearing a blazer, which was from H&M last year, but I have seen that they have a super similar one online at the minute. Um, that's also linen like this one and mango have one that's near enough identical as well so i will leave those two linked 
Um, and then I'm wearing a little like vest, which is from H&M. This is new in. Um, it's kind of like a very fine knitted material. And it's like a nice like V-neck shape. Um, I have got a bra on with this as well. And it kind of like keeps slipping a tiny bit, but you can near enough get away with it. So I will leave the bra that I'm wearing linked as well because that's from H&M too. Um, and then my jeans are from Zara. I wear these all the time. In fact, I have three pairs of them now, which is ridiculous, but I just could not live without these jeans. Um, they are the high rise straight leg and they're just the best wash ever. Um, and then my shoes are an old Zara, um, like block heeled mule, but I'll try and find something similar. Um, and then finally, I have my Jacquemus Bambino bag. Um, but yeah, I am actually running I'm on time, which is very unlike me, um, but I'm just going to order an Uber now and get on my way. So it is now Friday and I am all packed up and ready to go back home to Blackpool for the night. Um, we're just going to go and see some family um, and this is actually what I am packing to wear tomorrow, but I thought I would just quickly show it you now because obviously I'm not going to be here to show you then. Um, so I am wearing a midi dress, which is like a knitted midi from from Jack Wills. Um, I absolutely love this. It is so flattering. I love the neckline and the length is great. Um, it's got like a slit up one leg but nothing crazy. Um, and yeah, I just love this so much. I actually did a ad with them over on Instagram um, last month. And yeah, this is what I picked out for that. And I've just been wearing it so much since. So love that. Um, and then I'm wearing a blazer from Naked. Um, I'm not sure if this one will still be available, but they always seem to have some really good like beige oversized blazers in. So I'll try and link something similar. Um, and then my first outing for the Chloe sliders this year. Uh, hopefully they aren't gonna tear my feet to shreds because you do have to wear them in a little bit. And I find like when I've not worn them for a while, then it just reverts back to being incredibly painful again. So we'll see how that goes. Um, and then my bag is my Celine Triumph. Um, but I am thinking of going out for some drinks tomorrow afternoon. So I will swap out the sandals for some heels and add a clutch bag. And then here is today's outfit. Um, so I am wearing a knit black crop top from Zara. I wear these all the time in the summer. They're such a handy basic to have and they just go with everything. Um, I definitely have seen them online this year as well so I will leave those linked. Um, and then my trousers are from Mango. Um, just a really comfortable outfit. And like I've said a million times before, they are the best length ever if you are petite. Um, I'm five foot two and yeah, they just work so well with trainers. Sorry, I just ran out of storage there, but I think I was saying that my Vasures um, are the Esplar style. Um, and then I've just got the same black bag and um, I've also got a black blazer because when I was getting dressed, um, it was really overcast and cloudy, but now the sun seems to have made an appearance, which is always nice for a bank holiday. Um, and then I also just wanted to show you my case. Um, this just arrived this week from Antler, um, and they very kindly sent me like a full set of matching cases. So they sent me like three different sizes. Um, this one is the cabin size. So I'm just taking that home. It's so nice, I love the color. And it also matches really well with my Katie Loxton weekend bag. So yeah, really happy with those. Um, but I need to head off to the station now. So I will catch up with you on Sunday. So it is Easter Sunday today and we are just about to head out for a um, walk. We are also going for a bit of a pub crawl. Um, I've got my rosé in my insulated bottle um, and I'm very excited. We're going with some friends, so that will be lovely. Um, and it is glorious weather for the bank holiday too, which is just amazing, that's what we want. Um, but I am wearing quite a casual outfit because obviously we are going for a walk first. Um, and then I'm gonna take a dress with me as well um, in the car to get changed into for when we go to the pub. Ran out of storage again. <laughs> But the outfit I am wearing is a basic um, black ribbed bodysuit from Zara. Um, I imagine they will have this in again this year, so I will leave it linked. Um, my shorts are H&M last year, but again, I'm hoping they will bring these out again because I find with like their denim styles, they tend to bring them back like season after season. Um, and these are my favourite because um, the top of my legs aren't my favourite feature. So they're a really good length, like they cover 
your bum and like the top of your legs which is great um, and they're quite comfortable too and then I have a shirt over the top just an oversized one from Zara again this is from last year but I have seen that they do have a similar one on there at the minute um, my belt is my Zara one that I wear all the time and my shoes are just my Vajas for um, comfort really so it's now bank holiday Monday and um, on today's agenda is going out to shoot a load of content for Instagram um, including this outfit that I'm wearing now so I thought I'd just show you this one um, so I have on a racer neck sage green vest from Arquette and then my jeans are from weekday these are the row jeans um, and they're just like quite a nice slouchy straight leg fit I have them in a waist 24 I think um, and the length I went for is the shortest one um, and they're a great length actually um, I am five foot two I'm sure I've said that before in this video but yeah and I'm just wearing some tan sandals from mango um, and then I have a white linen shirt over the top um, I kind of like this vibe where you just wear a basic racer neck vest with a shirt over the top um, I think it looks quite effortless kind of like off-duty model vibes in fact I think it was Kendall Jenner who made this look go viral last year um, but yeah, really casual and um, good for like a slightly cooler day as well, having that extra layer. Um, and then my bag is my Loewe basket bag. I love this so much. Um, I think that slightly more structured shape um, works better for my style because um, I think it can be dressed up a little bit more than, you know, the standard kind of like oversized basket bag can. Um, so yeah, I love that and I cannot wait to wear it all summer long again this year. Um, but yeah, that is today's um, look. Well, my first look of maybe like four today. Um, but I am going to end the video here. Um, I really hope you enjoyed seeing what I wore in just over a week. Um, I hope it was useful as well. Hopefully you can get some spring outfit ideas from the video. But yeah, let me know if you did enjoy it and I can definitely do more of this style of video. Um, they are so quick and simple to do. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I will hopefully see you in next week's video.